Two people are dead crashing a car into a security checkpoint at high speeds. It happened at the U.S.-Canada border. Now multiple northern border checkpoints are closed. We have live updates. Israel vowing to resume fighting in full force immediately after the temporary ceasefire. What's coming as the White House says one task remains extremely urgent. And dozens of lawmakers have already decided to step down during the next election. Many say they're frustrated. Arian Pazdar takes a closer look at the situation in the nation's Congress. A sheriff in Texas visits Israel and witnesses the sights of the Hamas atro atrocities. He joins us to share what he learned and the lessons he brought back for the U.S. And growing frustration in Chicago over the impact of illegal immigration.